Aloe vera leaves are comprised of three parts, the skin, the gel, and the latex. We both have a latex allergy. Hi, welcome to our video, Matt Lane Fitness, whatever other you say. Oh my god, that's- Hey, I'm Matt, from Matt Lane <laughs> apparently. <laughs> I said Matt Lane Fitness and whatever other you say. Got it, okay. Coming out of the gate strong. Already a few beeps, so fantastic. <laughs> Is this how this is gonna go? Yes. <laughs> it's sharp. If you're new to this channel, I appreciate you sliding by. Welcome to my series here, I Try Blank for the First Time. And today is no different. We're trying something new. <laughs> Aloe vera. Did you know you could eat it? I haven't Googled any of this. The idea behind this series is to approach something that you've never done with the idea, let's try to learn something. Let's broaden our horizons, man. There's mental... So that's why we don't do any research ahead of time. That's exactly right. So there's mental fitness born in here. Mental fitness, I feel, is the most important aspect of fitness. It is that behavior change that's gonna give you that long-term wellness. Let's dive into eating aloe vera. I've heard all my life that, oh my gosh, you can use it on your skin. You can put it up your hole. You can do all sorts of stuff and it will I've heal I've never you. heard that. Oh yeah, it's a common thing. So everybody knows, Heals sunburns if you put it on there, but what does it taste like? Have you ever tried aloe vera? I didn't ask you that. I never asked no, you if you- I haven't tried it. You have not? Well, I put it on my skin. We have our own aloe vera plant, although these make our plant look pretty inadequate. Yeah, this one's well endowed. So, ow, jeez, Christ. It's kind of sharp. If you've never held an aloe vera plant, it's got like this, uh, it's kind of squishy feeling, but firm at the same time. Is it like a firm jello? It's not like a firm jello. It's not like the purple mattress. A little ASMR here. Should I use the. Yeah, use the watermelon knife. The watermelon knife it is. Oh. Smell it. It's clear in there. It is clear. Clear! You just jumped. <laughs> you think that's funny? Okay. This is what it looks like on the inside. It smells very fresh. Hey, who am I? Just to like fillet it like a fish. I don't want to know how to cut it. I want to figure it out as I go. That's another part of this series is that I don't Google how to do any of it because I want to learn as I go. So real sticky, like Jenna says, smells real fresh-like. You should cut it down the middle, right? Nailed it. Right down the middle. It's like a gel. <gasps> Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Huh. This is looking pretty dope, actually. Whoa. Trippy. It's like alien goo. Okay, Jenna, here is your first glob of aloe. Feels much different than coming out of the, uh, out of the, out of the, what's the pourable thing? The bottle? The bottle, Jesus, that took a while. Okay, very, very slimy, like real slimy. Ew. No, crack a whole thing in. It. I did it, I put a bite in my mouth. It doesn't really have much of a taste. It reminds me of a cucumber. It's like a slimy cucumber. It's not bad, actually. I wonder, do people eat this like as a staple anywhere? You know, we would know if we did any okay, research. Okay, well Google it, Google it. <laughs> it's pretty slimy. We've all been there. Right? No, Jenna! <laughs> oh, I got it on the mic. His mic. Come on, Jenna, you gotta let that joke go. Like you've only ever experienced aloe vera in like a bottle with some sort of scent to it. So you don't associate it in its raw form until you get it in front of you. And uh, I don't know, it's kind of it's kind of cool. And that's why we do this series. Aloe vera has vitamins B, C, E, and folic acid. And it okay. also contains small amounts of calcium, copper, chromium, sodium, selenium, magnesium, potassium, manganese, and zinc. Wow. It also is one of the only plant sources of vitamin B12. Really? Mm hmm It's good for heartburn relief. Digestive benefits, uh, constipation, clear skin. You can add a makeup primer and remover sunburn soother, a moisturizer for an irritated scalp, and it's supposed to detox your liver. You feel healed? 
Be all healed. Getting your skin here. Your skin looks better already. Your, your skin's all shiny. <laughs> <laughs> now the question is simple. Will the dogs like aloe vera? Let's give it a shot. Try some aloe vera. She did not like it. She dropped it. Roman, you're up. Oh, no dice. Nova. Try the aloe vera. Try it. Yeah, they didn't like it at all. They, did, they didn't try it. Where's this grown? I, I know it's even, it's grown in the US and all that, but like, I wonder where it's native to. It mainly grows in dry regions of Africa, Asia, Europe, and America. <laughs> all right, we made the list finally. This is the first time we've tried something food-wise that's uh, like native to the didn't US. didn't say it's native, it just well, says it's where it grows. All right, well, fine. Native to Africa, Madagascar, and the Arabian Peninsula. Pel Arabian Peninsula. Let's look at some calorie content here. Aloe vera water, aloe vera juice, aloe vera. Thanks, babe. So, healthline.com says aloe vera leaves are comprised of three parts the skin, the gel, and the latex. We both have a latex allergy. I'm sorry, what? So this is our last video here on the channel. Appreciate you guys. Please subscribe as we die. I don't think it's like latex latex. Uh, I mean, it's, it's on the internet. It's gotta be true. The gel and the latex. I'm thinking the latex is like the slimy part because that's the gel, that's the leaf, that's the, it's fine. My throat's closing up, but no big deal. Seriously, we'd be like itching and whatnot mm -hmm. right now if it was legit latex. Thank you, appreciate it. That's, oh, I'm good, all right. Awesome. Calories. One tablespoon, six. <laughs> one tablespoon is six calories, and it looks like zero protein, zero fiber, zero carbs. So, I mean, if you're looking for for micronutrients, sounds like this is your thing. Don't really need to shoot for this to hit your macros. Not really going to do the trick trick for macro content. I am trying to. I'm trying to. Just trying to help your skin. This was not <laughs> scripted. This was not scripted. You're doing it to me while I was trying to talk. I didn't do your face, you know. <laughs> you think that's funny? If she makes you have a No, 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 no. <laughs> so, what have we learned? Aloe vera. <laughs> No calories. If you want to shoot for the micronutrients, it's got it, okay? I appreciate you sliding by. I have something that is coming. <laughs> November 2nd, I am launching the 30 Day Full Body Group Challenge. There is a link in the description below if you want to join. I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. I think you're gonna get a lot of value out of it. I'm really excited about it. Basically, <laughs> you get access to my app. You get access to me. We're gonna be doing weekly Zoom calls with everybody in the group. We're going to go at your fitness using behavior change. For 30 days, you'll be inside my app. We're gonna make some progress. Let's do it. Click the link down below and support a small creator here that rubs aloe vera on himself to hopefully entertain you even though he has an allergy to latex and this may be my last video. You don't have to be perfect at this aloe vera thing. Just try to be better than yesterday. I'm just trying to be a good boy. Every day. I'm trying to help you skid out. Jenna, this was way too far. <laughs> it looks like Jenna. I feel like I've just been in like a 90s like kids game show. Yeah, right. You get like slime at the end. 